are actually getting to the point where we almost feel comfortable allowing people to text and drive, which is kind of the killer app. Because that, that, that's really what people want to do, and, and do do. Uh, um, and uh, actually, <laughs> right now, the, you know, the versions, you know, the car's a little uh, strict about keeping your eyes on the road. Um, and, uh, but I'm confident that in the next month or two, uh, we should, we, we, we're going to look closely at the safety statistics, but we will allow uh, you to um, text and drive, essentially. <laughs> We've got the, the first car that is specifically built for uh, uh, unsupervised full self-driving to, to be a robo-taxi. It's called a cybercab. It doesn't even have pedals or a steering wheel. Um, <laughs> yeah. So, no, no, there's no side view mirrors. There's no uh, yeah. So it's it's and, and it's, it's very much optimized to for for the lowest cost per mile in our, in an autonomous mode. Um, and that production is happening right here in this factory, and we'll be starting production in April next year.